Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to set up kits in Byte Skywars. So first let's go over to the file manager and then the plugins folder and then click on Byte Skywars and then kits. Now you'll see only one file here. Let's open that first. And here's everything for the default kit. Uh, first let's copy all of this. And then we're going to make a new file. Let's just call it kit2.yml. Click OK. Now open that, and we're going to paste what we just had in there. The first line is the cost, so we're going to change that. And then you want to change this to whatever you named the kit file, so we're going to name it kit2. Now we're going to go down to lore unlock, and this will basically show what comes up when you hover over the kit. So I'm going to keep these parts as is, but because I'm going to change the items, we're going to change these to stone. Now this section doesn't actually change the kit items, so to do that we have to come down to the item list down here. And the first part is we have to change all of the item IDs, which I'm doing now. The second number is the amount of the item. The third number is the data value. And the fourth part is the enchantment. So the name part, that is the enchantment. And then after the colon is the enchantment level that you want to set. So as an example, we're going to do sharpness level three. And then for this part, we're going to change it to efficiency level three as well. And then I'm going to put this same enchantment on the other item. So I'm just going to copy and paste that here. And then the slot. The slot is the location in the inventory that will show up for the kit when you select it. So because we already have a default kit on slot 0, we want to change that one so that it comes up on slot 1 rather than the same slot as the other one so that they don't override each other. Once you're done with that, let's click save, and now we have two kit files. So basically, every time you want to make another kit, you have to make a new file completely, have it named something else, and you have to change the slot number so that they don't override each other. Once you're done with that, let's go back to my server and click restart. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to check the description for more Byte Skywars tutorials.